So I saw on Instagram that Targets are getting this new Kaioken SH Figure Arts Goku figure, and we're gonna hit up a Target anyway. I gotta pick up some other stuff. Let's go on a Figure Arts Dragon Ball Z Toy Hunt to Target. I just wanna toy hunt. I just wanna toy hunt. I just wanna toy hunt every day. Wow, it's my first time in Target in a few months, no joke. And of course we got MJ's. Wow, this is like, is this the uh, Peg Warmer Hall of Fame right here? We have the Landos and the MJ's, man. That is the Peg Warmer Hall of Fame. Oh, would you look at this. <laughs> oh. Kids are up to, uh-oh. We got the kids doing some crazy stuff in here. All right, any Marvel Legends? We got the Iron Man. Wow, these are really selling. And what's in here? Did we score? Oh man, no way, we got the Marvel. We got the mushy Marvels. I'm super mushy, no way. No freaking way. But yeah, we got one Marvel Legend left. That's nuts, right there. Uh, we got some G.I. Joe. Who's this guy? It's got a dog. That's an articulated dog. That's really cool. Wow, that's actually this is a cool set. Not for 50, 45 bucks. Woo -wee. Cool. 90 bucks. I could buy a mule. Oh. Here we go. This is something new. The Bane looking crazy. I like that. It's like a ski mask type. Hmm. Could this be what Bane looks like in the new Batman movie? Spoiler. Wow. I seriously have not been toy hunting since Christmas, guys. That's how crazy it's been. And what the sad part is, these shelves aren't even like, look at it. I'm not even missing anything. What are you guys doing? What are you guys doing at your stores? Are you still, are people still toy hunting? Let me know down below. I want to get that Kaioken Batman. Bat Kaioken Batman. I want to get that Kaioken Goku. So they had these tech deck things with the skateboards with the little dioramas and those were cool. I did a review up on the channel years ago and now we're getting them with the bikes, which is cool. Look at that. You get a little guardrail, you get a little ramp. Now we need GT dinos. We need the GT companies. I don't know any of these new biker companies. Who here remembers GT though? GT dino I had see any cool cars this is a nice set i have a review up on the channel of this i love the first i like the first two fast and furious movies i really enjoy i don't remember tokyo drift i have to rewatch that again Ooh, they got the porsche 911 right here i think i gotta get this oh and they got the no way that's a, those two are really those are nice. Hold on, I love Porsche 911s. I know that's that's really like not like a crazy. I don't know. I I'm pretty sure people like that car. That's like a cool, cool car. But what do they got over here? Anything cool? Wow, Hot Wheels has been sen selling. Look at that. Hot Wheels is empty. All right, we're in the card section right now, just checking it out, and you know the AEW hype is over. These don't look like any of them sold. And a lot of the sports cards, are people stopping with the reselling and the stonks? Pokemon, I haven't kept up with the Pokemon cards at all. I, I didn't get any of these 151. Sometimes I buy the Dragon Ball Z cards, I don't see any right now, but what's this? Jet Burn, oh, My Hero Academia, all right. All right, let's go. We're here at the collector spot and I noticed this. What is this? Is this the ship? Oh, it is the ship. So it's like a little miniature ship. And then they have another one over here of the, uh, so this is the Mary and then they have the Sunny. So that's pretty cool. Oh yeah, see Sunny, Mary. But here, oh, there's something back there too. All right, it's getting, it's all stuff in the way. And what is this? We have Ninja Turtle, NECA. Haven't seen these in a while. Ooh, got a Godzilla. 
in black and white. They caught him in black and white. Look at that. Thunderosa clearance. Not really, though. The Gohan. Oh, hold on. That's pretty crazy. Look at the box of silver. Is this autographed? Oh no, it's just it's just the guy. These things do not sell. Just get them away. I don't know. These things have been here for years. You now this is cool. Wow, this line's pretty deep already. He went pretty deep on this line. Look at that. And then here we go. This is the line to collect. But, okay, I'm not seeing them. I see some Dragon Ball Z, but no Kaioken. Wow, look at that. What's he so angry about? And then, here we got Goku Black. Wow, a lot of anger. These should be called the anger sets. Ooh, damn, look at these. Oh, they got, oh, look. So I'm looking for Usopp. You think they got Usopp? No. Oh. Always got to clean up after yourself. Always got to clean up. People make messes. You got to clean them up. And then, okay, this is where he should be. Let's see. Did we get him yet? Can we get all this Funko stuff out of here? Uh, anything? There's just so much junk everywhere. No. <sighs> Damn. All right, I had to literally go look for it. They threw the Star Wars stuff into the back, back end of the toy section, which is not a good sign. And we still got a bunch of Lonely Landos. We got this chick. Oh. Now, wait, hold on. What is that supposed to look like? Hey, yo. Well, I'm out, man. I don't know if it's just the time I came to Target. It's like around five o'clock. I never come at this time. I've never seen it so busy. And also, Lego is very popular. The Lego aisle has been filled with girls. I'm very surprised. I mean, I know Hun, my wife, for new viewers, you should know who Hun is, but girls like Lego. And it's, I've never used to see people in there. Now it's like no kids are in the Lego aisle, it's only adults. Interesting. No Kaioken, we're gonna keep looking though. That is something I am toy hunting for. All right guys, we are in TJ Maxx right now. They're getting a lot of toys, as you could see. And it smells like straight up dookie. Like some old lady just took a 100% poop in her Depends. What? And it's stanking right now, but. We're gonna be looking. There's like so many things that people are finding. And it's like, I have not seen them yet. Like I'm trying to, I'm trying to find some of these good deals. Nope. Where are all the Marvel Legends? Where are all the elite figures, the wrestlers? Like, oh, here we are. Oh, everyone has the LeBron and I want him for a meme and all my stores that are near me have this. I don't even know who those guys are. Ugh, that is, that's so frustrating. Nobody wants those guys. They didn't even want LeBron. What a waste, man. I always go like, I don't want to stop in one of these stores, but I'm like, you got to stop. You got to stop in them. Oh man. So I didn't wind up filming, but I did make a TikTok of this I found these WWE Alexa Bliss plush dolls and these were on a, a random table the guy sold them both to me for five dollars for both of them and they both sell for like eighty dollars each so this was a really great find I didn't find much else though that day guys look how big this is it is humongous the box is bigger than I thought it was gonna be I just picked up 
the time machine finally the figure eyes i wanted this like 10 years ago and i paid a pretty penny we are going to be doing a dragon ball z setup in these detolf cabinets and i have one that i'm working on with the diorama and everything there it is next to a six inch action figure that's goose faba right there let's build this thing one eternity later we are here on a toy hunt right now and i just literally picked up a PS5, I just did it. It was on sale and then I had the red card so we saved more money and now we're doing it. We're doing a post PS5 pickup toy hunt. Let's go. I seriously stopped looking at the section because it's just like, there's been nothing that new that came out worth looking at. Oh, what's that? Not Fast and Furious. They got some, oh, buy one, get one 50% off. Not bad, I like that Triple H. I'll get it when it goes on uh, clearance though. How many Triple H's do I need that look exactly the same? And then here is the Marvel Legends section and we already got the Kingpin. Oh wait, 50% off? Action figures and play sets? For real? Wait, the aisles are saying different things. Is it 50% off or not? Got the G.I. Joe figures, multiverse. All right, and I'm not seeing, usually they hang up the good stuff over here. I'm seeing Fortnite. I'm not seeing, oh, there's one Power Ranger left. There was like racks of those, so somebody's been here. Some collector or reseller has been here, cleaned them out. I'm not seeing anything on this side. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything right now. Let's see, there's still more aisles. You know, sometimes people put things where they don't belong. You never know. You never know. I see some Pokemon toys that are still brand new in other stores. That's just a, the crazy thing is now, these stores aren't even sales stores or clearance. Look at this, Jujutsu Kaisen statue, $16.99. These are, this is like Japanese stuff right here. That's crazy. That's crazy they got that. That's awesome. That's an awesome find right there. Uh, I don't have much use for statues though. All right, anything over here? They got the Mario right there. And then they had this little table. Oh, look, here's another Power Ranger corner. Looks like somebody got to this place. But that's the whole point of toy hunting, right? You guys never know until you try. All right, let's go to another store. I'm just breaking in to say, make sure you're hitting that like button. And if you want to support the channel, I have a PO box. Everything you guys send in gets opened up in its own video. So if you want to be part of a fan mail video, boom. If you want to support even more, I have channel memberships. You enjoy a lot of exclusive content, even some channel members only live streams and they're uncut and unedited. So if you want a little bit more spice in your life, definitely become a channel member. A lot of stuff was planned for 2024, so enjoy and let's get back to the toy hunt. Hey, yo. All right, guys, little update. Let's put the lights on, beautiful. I threw these guys in here. They look really nice, but we're gonna be moving this. So um, I think, do we keep Resident Evil on the top right here? I think so. Uh, I think we're going to all right, we're gonna have to move this. I like this, I just did this for like a random shot, like just to see. All right, so um, I think I did a video alone on the diorama, but I did this quick little diorama with just junk pieces that I had really quick. Like this is one of the quickest dioramas I did. I just, I haven't did one in like a year or maybe longer than a year. I used to have a diorama channel. If you guys remember, whoever remembers that. We built, so we built the time capsule or a time machine. Hold on. Oh, we're going to have to put this in here. I think it fits. Ah, oh, yeah, it does fit. Okay. So uh, that was the plan, right? And I don't know if you guys saw it in the video, but it came with a huge crack in the freaking dome in the front of the dome. So mad, but the seller refunded it. So it was basically free. So I'm not, I'm not complaining, but that was really unfortunate. And the whole thing was I built the entire thing and then the dome was cracked. So it just sucked really bad. We got that in there. So this is so far looking how I want it to look. Now, 
Now, this is the cell shell that it, it, this actually came with a cell shell. It's not like the figure arts one though. It's very cheap and it's hollow. So I have the figure arts one. I just need to do a review of it. So uh, as of right now, that's gonna stay there until I do the review. And All right, so we have Trunks. I guess I'll put him, I'm gonna have to change his hair because it makes no sense that he would be uh, Super Saiyan. Uh, one of my favorite characters and figures that I own. Oh, guys, yes. This is literally, oh, that's, I have a picture of reference that I wanted to this diorama thing to look like. And it looks just like it. I'm super happy. I actually don't even mind him Super Saiyan right there, but this looks great. I'll probably keep that until they get a Gohan, a kid Gohan figure and a Bulma figure. You know, when they go look at the, the thing, but I think that looks great. So we're going to change his hair eventually. And I'm going to get the cell shell from the figure arts and trade it out. But guys, what do you think? That looks amazing so far. I'm very happy. You know, what? I'm just going to change his hair real quick. All right, guys, that is it. We are done for now. I am very happy how this is going. And this is only the first of a few dioramas. We are going to actually upgrade a lot of these. And they're all going to have a diorama base. And we're going to have some figures on it. And they're not going to be so packed. Maybe we even turn this into like a little Raccoon City Police Department diorama. And so on and so forth. Even the Power Rangers, like that's just too crowded. It doesn't look nice. I'd rather have just maybe the whole group with a little bit of the sand, you know, like uh, where they're always fighting in the sand. As of right now, guys, how does that look? Uh, really cool. Look at that. Just look at look at the way it shines just out of the rest of these. Let me know down below if you like this video. If you like more kind of laid back videos like this in the toy room, doing the detail shelves. Do you want me to update you guys when I do some other shelves and all that stuff? Leave comments down below and check out these two videos that are on the screen. Even if you've seen them before, clicking on one of them helps out the channel. Stay great, guys. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.